Hi, Rich. Are you ready to start the podcast? I'm as ready as I'll ever be, Matthew. Ask me if I'm ready. Mm, I'm not sure if I'm ready to ask you if you're ready. Oh. You want me to ask you so bad. I want you to ask me. Okay. Right. Okay. Uh, are you ready? What? No, I'm, I'm ready to... I just you asked to, uh, you. you. No, but I'm so ready for not you ready. to ask no. me. Sorry, oh. everyone, uh, for tuning into the podcast. And Matt's not ready. Are you ready? Yes, I am ready. Ah, oh, thank goodness for that. Hi, everybody. I hope you're ready. We're going to ask you now if you're ready to listen to our podcast. And I guess you'll just... Say it. Say it. Listener, are you ready? Yeah! yeah we're hoping that you said yes. Are you 110% ready? Extra points for those of you that said technically impossible, but okay, let's go. Now, I, I, I guarantee there's a couple of wags out there, a couple of larrikins out there who said no... <laughs> Welcome to the Listies Make You Lolcast. My name's Rich, and this is. Uh, oh, wasn't ready oh again. I wasn't ready again. I'm so sorry. Go ask me this time, and I'll be ready. My name's Rich, and this is Ready. Ready. Oh, we're just going to call you Ready. Okay, my okay. name's Ready for this episode. Okay, it's ready. just us today because Nan's off. Is she? Yeah, because it's just a little tiny episode. This is a, this is a mini episode. Rich, do you want to tell everybody why? What? Do you want to tell everybody about your elbow? Yeah, I broke my elbow. Rich broke his elbow. Oh. Do you want to tell everybody how it happened? Well, I wish it was really like a spectacular way of breaking your elbow. Like maybe I was, I got drafted into like a wrestling match and yep. I did one of those flying elbows from the top rung and then missed the person and did a massive elbow smash on a table or something. Yeah. But it's not, I just fell off my bike. <laughs> Oh, buddy. Is it okay? Is it sore? It is sore. It's not as funny as they say. You know, they say you're funny, bone. Turns yeah. out it's not funny. Oh, ouch. Can yeah. I also just say that what? You, you broke your elbow. I did. But I am just now looking. Yeah. Um, did you break your bum too? Why? Because there is a big crack right down the middle of it. Matt, that is very triggering. <laughs> that is triggering, okay? So we're just going to do a short episode. Yes. And what we thought we might do is we've got some really good jokes from... We do. And we've also just had so much fan mail. Oh, yeah. I think it's the bum potato effect. Uh, we got that We got that bum potato bounce, didn't we? Yeah, we sure did. Also, our Instagram has been full of people sending us photos of fruit that looks like butts. And vegetables, and, Matt. <laughs> and we're Should we talk about that now? Let's, yeah, let's talk about that. our box right now. So yep. I guess I was expecting peaches. Yeah. Because it's, you know, it's the emoji. They begin the, looking like bums. They do. They? I mean, it's it, not a surprise that a peach looks like a butt. So we had Jessica, she said in a picture of a peach, yep. you know, it looks like a bum. Yep. But then I wasn't, I wasn't, I was a bit surprised by butt mushroom. I... <laughs> Rich, they have button mushrooms, but do they have oh, bottom mushrooms? So true. Yep. So we've got a bottom mushroom. Is yeah, but they, they call it butt mushroom. Yeah, okay. Um, butt mush. Oh, but, that's, yeah, that's they, rude. They abbreviated it to butt mush. Yep. But I think surely it should be mush butt. Rich, everyone does their bum mushroom in a different way. They do, do they? I don't want to yuck no one's yum, but I'm not <laughs> eating that. <laughs> I'm not eating that. I mean, Actually, yeah, so I would eat it. We don't need any more pictures of any butt, butt mushrooms. Yes, no, we've got a butt mushroom. But if you have another fruit that has a butt in it or a vegetable, or even if you just see a stone that looks like a bum. Oh, uh, no, I yeah. don't want any more bum resembling things. <laughs> okay, listen, I was going to say don't send us any more pictures of butt mushrooms because there's not mushroom left in the inbox. That is good. Did you like that audience in a can? <laughs> big fans. Yeah, they did big like fans, that. Big fans, big fans. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's very nice. We also got a pair. We got a pair, Matt. Someone said a bum Wait, pair. Wait, we got a pair of bums? No, uh, Ren Richard. And look at the picture. It really looks like an old, <laughs> <laughs> like a little old bum. <laughs> that, again, <laughs> some of these aren't safe for work. I don't know whether I could read that on a bus. While we're doing readers' letters, yes, or listener Rich. letters, mm. uh, hi, Rich and Matt. Mm. You bring a lot of joy to our family. Oh. Oh. Our son thinks very highly of the listies. The other day, he wanted to Google the listies' net worth. What's that mean? Well, it's how much your net is worth. You know when we go fishing? Yeah. You've got that little net. Yep. It's when you get the fish out or the crab mm. or the cray. Mm. You have to put a little net under it. What's our net worth? Oh, it's $2.50? About, yeah, it's not expensive. Yeah, well, we just got it from uh, the $2 shop. Yes, yeah, so the there you go. Hot potato. There you go, Nevi. Hot bum potato. Our net is worth $2.50. Wow, oh, that's cool. Yes. What other letters did we get? Okay, this one's from Elizabeth. Hi, listies. This is a question for Matt. Oh, yeah. Matt, listen up. 
Okay, oh, I'm listening. <laughs> this is what she says. I know you play the ukulele and yes. you're very good at it. Thank I wouldn't you. say that, Elizabeth. Yeah, thank you. I wouldn't say that's that. The, oh, that's really nice. He's, Stop reading. That's okay. it. That's no, the no. Okay. I wondered if you play the acoustic guitar. <laughs> Not to be confused with the acoustic guitar. I think she's made a spelling mistake there. No, Rich, I think because that... Because it's acoustic guitar, uh, not acoustic. Acoustic guitar. If you do, I'd love to hear you play it. Love, Elizabeth. Well, um... So we're going to hear this, Matt? Have you, uh, got a, have you got an acoustic guitar here? I actually do. I'm just going to uh, put it up here. And this, cause here we go. Oh, what's that smell? Oh, it stinks. Is that a, an acoustic guitar? Twinkle, twinkle, little... Oh, how I wonder what you... Oh, this stinks. This is a very enclosed space. That is the acoustic guitar. I will be releasing an acoustic album called <laughs> Matt Unplugged. <laughs> Matt Unwiped. Matt Unwiped. My acoustic guitar album is called Matt Unwiped. Okay. Now... What other letters? We've got kid jokes. Oh, okay. So we love getting jokes from people in yes. our inbox. So if you have jokes or if you have made up a joke, send it to us and we will get audience in a can to uh, say whether it's good or not. <laughs> they love it. Greg, the drummer's back. Thanks, Greg. Thanks, Greg. Is your name Greg? Do a ba if your name's not Greg. Okay, it's definitely okay, Greg. Okay, it's then. definitely yep, Greg. Okay. Yep. Here we go. Joke coming up. This one is from Rose. Thanks, Rose. <laughs> and the subject line was all hail Matt and Rich. Like Ooh. we're Roman emperors. Yes. Thank you for that. Hi, Listeroonies. Mm. Now, do I read out the emojis? What do people expect nowadays? Oh, read them. If they're there, read them. Okay. Hi, Listeroonies. Love heart eyes. Love heart eyes. Love heart eyes. Poo, 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 poo. I'm totally your fan. Love heart eyes. Monkey, 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 monkey. Heart, heart. Banana, banana, banana. And this is the best letter we've ever gotten. Me and Bill listen to you every day. Whoa. All hail Rich and Matt. And, all caps. <laughs> okay. <laughs> why do dads always bring an extra sock to golf in case they get a hole in one? Oh, that is good. <laughs> Yeah! Well, yeah. No. <laughs> That's a good joke, isn't it? Thank you, Rose. If you want us to read your joke on the listies make you lolcast and make your joke famous, let's face it. Yeah, totally. Uh, you just have to write in to... Hello at the listies.com or you can put it on the Spotify interactive comment thingy that exists that Nan told me about that I don't really understand. Wow. What? what what's next? So, Matt... <laughs> Oh, you know what that sound means. Monkey Nan's back with the air horn again. No, no, no. That's the new <gasps> sponsor ideas. So we have to keep the lights on at the uh, podcast. Mm. We've got to keep the M&Ms in the scroggin. We've got to put the, keep the door flapping. We've got to keep the yogurt-coated peanuts in We've the muesli. Put the moat on the podcastle. We've got to keep the ice cubes in the cordial. All of these things have to happen, so we need sponsors. But luckily, we have very useful listeners who are always just giving us ideas about what companies should sponsor the podcast. Absolutely. So, so who have we yeah, got? They're pretty good. I'll just go through them. Uh, uh, there, who we go. Banana boat. Boats in the shape of bananas. Oh, that's good. Thank you. This one is all in caps. So I'm going to yell it, and it has an emoji. So, okay. The first word is potato yep. in all caps, and then the potato emoji. Okay. So I'll just say potato, potato, but just know that the second time I say potato, it's the emoji. Potato, potato, I will not do anything about that. <laughs> Mark. Wow. Okay. Uh, and Banana Boat was from William, I should say. Okay. Um, Among Butt, the video game about imposters who attack the crewmates who need to go number one or number two. <laughs> <laughs> no, so not Among Us, Among Butt. Ah, is that what that is? Can I suggest maybe we might contact the Among Pus, which is like about a, a bunch of pimples? I don't know what you're talking about. Okay. Hi, I'm a person. Oh, that's good. Because <laughs> on the internet, you can't tell. It's true. And I think Moolworths would be a sponsor. They sell cows. <laughs> that is good. That moo and poo all the time from Lucy. Thank Cause, you. Because they do. Hi, I'm Sylvie and I'm 10. And I think you should do Apple Watches. They are people who watch apples for you. <laughs> <laughs> That's really good. What about this cray station? It's like PlayStation, but you play as a crayfish oh. and you just swim around and do absolutely nothing and then you then you can't get fished. Oh, Matt, that would be what our net worth would be useful for. Oh, that is good. Yeah. We've got several suggestions for Bumming's Warehouse. Bumming's where, Warehouse. Where it's a 
Lois, like, trousers are just the beginning. <laughs> <laughs> but who is our real sponsor this week, I hear you ask? Who is our real sponsor this week? I actually wasn't talking to you. Oh. I was I thought... talking to the listeners at okay. home, so I'm just going to do that again. Okay. Who is our real sponsor this week, I hear you ask? Did you hear them ask? How can you hear them? What? I just heard them out. They just said it. They just said it. Okay. So this week's real sponsor. I'm a bit freaked out that you can hear them at home. Oh, no. Rich, I've just got really good hearings. Oh, good, good, sorry. Mm. Sorry to interrupt. That's okay. You're doing really well because you don't normally do the intros. It's normally me. Thank you. Okay. So I'm really right. trying. Over to you. Okay. <clears throat> Are you ready to sorry No, to I was just going to, I was just, I was I'm almost so ready. Sorry. That's all right, okay. That's okay, though. I don't mind. So this week's real sponsor oh. is the oh. Peaster Bunny. The, 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 what? Yeah. The Peaster Bunny? Yeah. Matt. What are you talking about? Oh, okay, so it's a magical creature yes. that appears yes. and leaves peas all oh. over the back garden on a special Sunday. So thank goodness for that, Matt. I thought it was I thought it was a oh, I thought it was an Easter egg that someone had weed on. Oh, actually, that's better. Do that no, one. No, I'm Good not luck, doing that one. It's disgraceful. Do you want to know who the second busiest bunny of the year is? It's me, the Peaster Bunny. That's right, I'm like the Easter Bunny, except I deliver peas that you can use in many different ways, but mostly through eating. You can put them in a pea soup with ham, if that's your thing. Pea and ham soup, that's good. Peas. The unfortunate thing about peas is that we share the name of a bodily function. That's right, let's get it out of the way, pea. It's peas have nothing to do with pee. It's just an unfortunate coincidence. Peas, try not to think about peeing. Also, just because I do sound a lot like the Easter Bunny, I don't actually turn up to the house and deliver. Um, do we just? I'm just a promotional tool, rather like the Energizer Bunny, and I'm just the mascot for peas. They thought, Peaster Bunny. I'm just a bunny that loves peas. Normally it's carrots, but this bunny, it's peas. Um, just want to make sure that you all realise that. Um, yes, peas, peas to bunny. Peas have nothing to do with peeing. Just that, that's that's the advertising campaign. That's a good sponsor, wow. isn't it? Yeah. yeah. And guess kind what? Kind of an existential. <laughs> it made me want to try peas. Actually, it made me want to pee. Okay. So I'm just going to be back in a sec. What the bunny specifically said, don't confuse the two. They're just an unfortunate coincidence, Okay. Yeah, that's yeah. true. But Matt, it's Comedy Festival here in Melbourne. Yes, and we're doing our show, Make Some Noise, at the Darabin Arts and Entertainment Centre in Preston, which is in Melbourne, which is in Australia, which is in the world, which is in the universe, which is in the Milky Way. <laughs> Thanks, audience in a can. And if you decide to come along, that will be good. But do you know what's bad? What's bad? Corrections. Oh, not again. I know. These are the things that we got wrong in the last episode of our lives. The following are not kinds of fish. The two-spotted candy flop, the Argentine burping guppy, and the crapsolotl. That's actually an amphibian. A hot dog is a food. A frozen camel is not a food. Mary had a little lamb. She did not have a little shark. Her shark was actually enormous. Is that right? Mm, it's a big one. Massive shark. Mm. The console to come after the Nintendo Wii was not the Nintendo Poo. They came out at the same time. That's not true, is it? Yeah, it is. is same time. They came out at the same time. Really? Yeah. Okay. Sorry about that. And this one is for any cats listening. Meow, 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 purr, meow, meow. We didn't want to get sued by yeah, a cat. Yeah, I, I don't want to get in trouble with Big Cat. <laughs> Thank you for listening to our mini episode. We'll be back next with our full episode. There'll be Richard's Poetry Corner. There'll be an episode from our lives. There'll be some fun with Nan. We are touring all over the place. If you want to see where we're touring and get all the information about the listies first, you can join our mailing list. Go to our website at www.thelisties.com. We'll see you at Comedy Festival if you live in Melbourne, though. Bye! Bye! The 
Listies Make You Lolcast is recorded on the lands of the Wurundjeri people of the Kulin Nation. This is the end. Are you still listening? Are you still listening? Because this is the end. Ma-